Hey, what's up, YouTube? This is Lawman FJ. Gonna take a quick look at another case for the Google Pixel 7 Pro. Now, this case is made by Humix. We're gonna go ahead and get started and take a look at this case and see what it's all about. Okay, you can get this case from Amazon. It's a Humix shockproof design for Google Pixel 7 Pro case, military grade protection, ultimate silky touch, translucent hardback, protective slim matte back case. All right. Now, the translucent case, I'm not a big fan of that but uh, because they seem to be more slippery to me. Uh, but it's got the matte, matte side, so that might help. Here's some pictures right here of the uh, case on the device. You can see that right there. Uh, and it says all-around drop protection. Okay, but I wanted to check it out because it looked good in the pictures. And I wanted to see how it fit the cases, all right? So I can let you know about that, all right? Now, you can get this case in different colors. You got black, green, light green, and transparent, okay? The different prices as well uh, when you get the different types of colors. Now this one is $17.99. You get a two dollar coupon when you clip this coupon, so that's pretty good. And you can get it on Prime. All right. Now I'll put the link in the description for you if you want to get it. Now here's the box that comes in right here. Pretty plain box. It's got a couple of pictures of a embossed uh, phones right there. Look like the iPhone, but not much information on the back. All right. Let's go ahead and take this case out. Uh, pretty simple packaging inside there. Uh, let's put this away. Now, um, here's the case, and there are lots of others out there that look like this as well. It's got a kind of hard piece, uh, PC back, uh, but it's translucent. You can't really see through it, but you get some, some visual, but not a lot. And you got the same piece up top as well. Camera opening is fine. It's going to be protected. It's raised up, and you got an opening for the uh, power button and the vibe down rocker. You got your mic, uh, you got your char charging port right here and your speakers. And it's pretty clean on the side right here. Mic hole in the millimeter wave is covered in that area right there. All right. Not sure if that impacts anything, but I haven't had any problems with it. Okay. Now we're going to go ahead and get the device and put it inside and see how it fits. Okay. Here's the Pixel 7 Pro. Let's go ahead and put this inside the case to see how it looks. All right. So it fits pretty snug. Not the tightest fit, but it fit pretty snug. Now, as I said, you got this translucent back and it's sort of slippery. Uh, not the most slippery phone, but it is slippery. It's not doesn't offer much grip there, but it's uh, not not bad. I think you could you could get used to it, but it's not the most secure feeling case. All right. Now uh, you see you got lip on the top and bottom, but not much lip on the side. So, but you can put you should be able to use a screen protector here. This this side doesn't come up a whole lot. So depending on how you drop this, you could damage the screen. All right. So you could be aware of that. Now the power button works fine, no problem. You got an opening for the charging port and your mic in your speakers right there no problem there uh and uh cameras well protected no problem there you see that and you got an opening for the mic that you can see right there so it's all, all lines up pretty well like i said power button works nice and clicky easy to use all right but um it's a slim case and uh you know you'll get some drop protection but you're not gonna be able to throw this across the room or anything like that it looks pretty decent looks pretty good you know the translucent back is not too frosted uh so i like that uh, and um, if you want something slim and you like the translucent back, that's going to be for you, all right? But to me, it, it, it doesn't offer as much grip as a regular uh, TPU uh, case with a clear back, okay? So, but, um, but I might put it in rotation and use it, you know, from time to time, as you can see. Uh, now, we're going to check out the wireless charge and see how this works on the device. Okay, so we got the wireless charger right here. Let's go ahead and put the device on. So it picked up wireless charge, no problem. Now let's see what it does when we stand it up. So it is charging, but I didn't get the animation. Um, let me set it back down, see if I can get that animation. So it did pick up, but it is charging. Sometimes it does that, I'm not sure why. Let's lay it down on the side and see what happens when we do that. So it picked up wireless charge there as well. So wireless charge works in all three positions. And this this is an old charger. It's a fast charger that Samsung put out in 2016. And sometimes the way it built is the way it's built, the stand is built, it can be awkward to charge. So if it charges on here, it's gonna charge on any other stand you have, okay? Okay, so that was a quick look at the Humix or Humix uh, shockproof case for the Google Pixel 7 Pro. I hope I didn't mispronounce that name, but if I did, please forgive me. Uh, but it's a decent case, you know, translucent back. If you like that, if you're okay with that, that's good. Not the slipperiest phone, but it doesn't offer as much grip as the, uh, say, the TPU case like this. We've got a clear back, smoke sides, and it's TPU. It's got a lot, a lot of grip, all right? 
Now, uh, but I think it's a good case. Now, it does cost uh, about uh, $17, uh, so a little more uh, on the expensive side. Uh, but but it, it can do the trick if you want something slim with a little bit of drop protection, all right? Now, I will put the link in the description for you if you, if you want to get this uh, case, all right? Now, if you got any questions, hit me up in the comments. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below for videos like this. This is Lawman FJ. Out.